All right, we are over here. There's the old river right, road right here. Yeah, 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 man. I think that's probably the best bet. Uh, first time like coming into this water right here. I, I mean, like I heavy came over here one time. Um, but it was fucking raining, and that was like last year, like around November. And this one is a little bit far after the bridge. There's a spot right here, man. This water is hella deep here. This like freaking deep, deep spot over here. I don't know if you guys can see it. Yeah, there. My boy Christian there. Fertile's right on the top somewhere. Fonz is coming over. Only problem is like, I don't think we can put like two poles each here, man. The fucking car is so strong. The car is strong over here, dude. I can't, I can't, I, I, I can't put like anything like anything after anything after four ounce. This one can only go four ounce right here. At least. Yeah, that's my max. Either that, man, I'm gonna end up breaking my tip. We're at this spot right here, but damn it, this place right here is what they call the 71 inch sturgeon two days ago. But that water over here is about 30 feet down, and the current was so damn strong. So it will be a challenge to be here. Everybody just gotta have to go use one pool because of. The location, the spot, it's not, it's not enough to uh, uh, facilitate two fishing pole each. And um, you're gonna have to use at least eight to 10 ounce of sinker on this spot. John, you need another beer? Yeah, I'll probably take one. Yeah. <clears throat> In order to uh, keep your line on a certain spot. Thanks, bro. Yep. All right. Here you go. So, it's gonna be a challenge. So right now, I didn't cast that far. I don't know how deep it is over here, but um, so far is it. My line is, it's keeping one spot right now. It's not dragging too much to the right. But everybody's using like 10 ounce, 12 ounce, I'm four, imagine that. Let's see how it goes today. New spot over here. I was getting a bite a while ago. But, um. I don't know what's shaking. But, uh, I ended up like rebaiting. See what happened. Alright, catch you guys again in a little bit here. Let's see what's up. And took 73 beeps at this new location. This is the um, old river road over here, Sacramento. This spot right here, the water is there's a really, really strong underground current. It's about 30 something feet down. Yesterday, a fisherman caught a 71 inch sturgeon in this spot here in this water using um, a ghost shrimp. One of my boy right now is trying to do the same thing. I uh, ended up advice some baits for that. Um, I'm planning to stay here that long, probably to like midnight, see what's up. Uh, you can't really use two fishing poles right now because the current is so strong. And it's just the distance where we at at this point that's fishable is not enough for four people for two poles each. We're just gonna end up getting tangled, especially all using braided lines over here at this point. Uh, so far, my first, my first throw, I was getting banged, but I cast that one kind of far. I can't really cast this far because I'm gonna tangle everybody's line. So right now, I must have probably only going to be around 15 feet, um, but it's a drop. 
so let's see what's up. But I don't know if you guys can see it. I'm gonna go ahead and turn on my, my light, see if you guys can see the water. There you go, check this out. I don't even know this freaking striper over here. Just leave it right there, dude. There's already on my line. With the current this strong, you're not even gonna know if you got a fish or not. But I line up this fucker right here. And this dude right here sucked it all the way in, man. Well, for the night, that breaks this conk again. Right there. I would say about good, probably 12, 13, 14. Boom. One. Just now. Oh, you guys can see it. Right here. Bam. Okay. We're losing this guy. Right now. Bam. Right here. Peace. I'm going to go ahead and release this dude right here. Oh, man. It's like I have to go walk all the way down here where the rock is. This. Shit. Come on, boy. Work with me, dog. I don't. I hope I won't fuck myself up here. Walking on all these damn rocks just to release this guy. All right, time to go, buddy. Back to your mama. Let's go. Go swim. He's still a little dazed. Look at him. Oh man, there you go. There's. There he is. Come on, dude. You can make it. You know, all that fucked up. Hey, you're coming back over here, dude. Come on, man. Get back over there. Go. Go. All right. Go ahead and swim. Swim away. Let me go check what my boys are doing out here right now. I'll do some cook out. Cook out right now. Alberto, the master chef. Freaking, look at that pit, though. Look at that pit. Improvise, baby. That's what's up. Oh, shit, man. I don't want to break my ass over here walking down in all these rocks. Check it out, man. That's some cool-ass freaking setup, though, with all the freaking, like, rocks going on there. Improvise, baby. Ooh. What's boiling going on there, dude? Man, was that a bone marrow with some uh, some beef? Holy shit, man, that looks fucking good, bro. Yeah, look at that, bro. Smoky, 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 man. Look at that. Look at all these freaking rocks. DIY over here, man. When you go down fishing, man, can't be fancy. Yeah. That's what's up. Right there. All, all Alberto's, Alfonso's already freaking knocked out over there. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for the bell. Make sure. <laughs> Wake me up when the bell rings. <laughs> right. I'm just going to chill right here. Wrapped up in a blanket. It would be nice if freaking like striper runs, bro, right? Mm -hmm. All in one spot. They start hitting all the freaking pull. Oh, yeah. That'd be crazy, man. Yeah. That happens over at that um, other side of Garcia, man. Remember what I was telling you? Oh, yeah. When I was. I could just freaking like. Look at Chef Alberto. I could just smack the head and freaking just drop it over here, man. It Hook and cook. When I first met Al Alberto, man. Ooh. That's like authentic right there. What's that? Really? Yeah. Mm. Well, oh, look at that, bro. <laughs> look right. at that. What I'm missing is the hot sauce. That's what's up. Mm. That's what's up right now. That's how you do it, man. Right here. That's the beauty about fishing, bro. 
that's part of it right here. For everybody, I'll get around and just getting a fucking damn beer and give them a little bit of cookout for everybody. With all the cilantro, you can't beat that, man. That's better than the fucking one in the restaurant, man. Shit. Selling it for like a dollar a pop for like a easy freaking like cooked food like this. All right, let me get mine. All right, there you go. I'm gonna try that. Boom. Look at that right there. Some carnitas, enchiladas, mi amigo, mi amiga. Muy buen, man, muy bueno. Yeah. See? Come with this. Ooh. Mm -hmm. God damn it, man. You can't beat that shit right now, bro. All right, I'm gonna stop this one. Hot as fuck, fuck up. Yeah. <laughs> you need some of those tapatayos or some freaking yeah, like yeah, that's what I'm saying. We're jalapenos, tapas, yeah. man. Some jalapenos right now, habaneros with that shit. Mm. Yeah, that's hella good, bro. Yeah, 